Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Tops Triple Threads Baseball 9 box inner case pick your team number 4. There it is right there. Big thanks to all of these folks right here. And you see the Nick Cam right there. Nick will be helping pop this case open. Let me show you the the list while he does that. There's the official team list printout. Dave, thank you very much. Double last spot mojo. He got the White Sox and the Dodgers in pick your team 4. A lot of number block teams as well. So we'll show you those. Those randomizers are separate videos. So there's the Mets, Phillies, blah, 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 blah one. There are the results of that. And then here are the results of the Toronto, New York Yankees number block right here. So good luck to everybody right here as well. We'll set these aside. Let's see what happens. Good luck, everybody. Now, D. Porter is in the chat. He was telling oh, us... Wow. That's a book. It's got to be, right? Feels like a book. Sometimes you feel like a book. Now, D. Porter was saying that standing room uh, only tickets for the Nationals Game 3, World Series Game 3, $1,200. All right, there's Babe Ruth, 99. What if it's a Babe Ruth bat knob? That would be, that would be pretty there. crazy. At a two fifty nine, Barry Larkin. We'll sleeve all of those. <laughs> just sitting next to pumpkins. Yeah. Dying to get some fresh air. Just oh, buried alive. look at this. This is a book. Oh, it was just kind of attached to that right there. No, that's a one of one. Trey Mancini, three games, three homers. He's a gamer. Nice one for the Orioles. Jim Morant picked up the Orioles straight up. Want to hit that? Bing, bing. Jim, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo, woo. It was a slow train today. It was a slow train, yeah. The allergies are slowing us down. All right, I'll set that right there. And the Yankees. That's Gary Sanchez. Six out of 36. Yankees six is for Nancy. Over there. And there's Robin Yount. All right. There's the book right there. Bam. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, that's that's a one of one, one yeah. right? MLB All Star Laundry Tag Book Card. Sounds pretty neat. All right, there's Max, Mad Max to 99, Nolan Ryan to 259. Some base cards. Let's grab the hit on the bottom first. That's Luis Gonzalez for Jim Morin. One out of 75. You got the Diamondbacks pinstripe and Luis Gonzalez's autograph, Jim Morin with the snakes. All right, and the book right here, 2019 Triple Threads Baseball. We have an MLB All-Star Game Laundry Tag Book Card behind old legend Tony Gwynn. And it's going to be... Oh, I don't know who it is yet. It's going to be... Mookie Betts, wow. We were just talking about DC a moment ago too. The all-star game in DC. You got a couple extra relics right there on the side. That is awesome. There it is, top left corner, one of one. I was looking for that. There it is. And who has the Red Sox? That's Jonathan Kent with the Boston Red Sox. Congrats, man. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. That's really sweet. Game three tomorrow in DC. I think first time they've hosted a World Series in like since the Washington Senators days. 
40s, 50s maybe? All right, nice book. All right, here's another stack right here. We got more triple threads in the store, folks. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Check it out. We've got plenty. Got plenty. But who cares? No big deal. I want more. All right. Splinter. Soto. Soto just been rocking the world. He might win a World Series MVP if he keeps this up. All right. Behind Ken Griffey Jr. is Miguel Andujar. 73 out of 99 for the Yankees. Marco with the Yankees 3. I like the new windows that they have this year for the relics. And behind Ken Griffey Jr. is Gary Sanchez. 30. Four out of 36. Marco with Yankees four. Logan, what's going on? We've got 18 out of 27. Don't, oh, oh don't test him? Have you ever seen the Ronda Rousey one? Oh, I guess he's made enormous strides in preventing stolen bases. Have you ever seen the Ronda Rousey one? But out of triple threats? Yeah, no. UFC triple threats. It's inappropriate, but it's really funny. Oh. <laughs> no, I'll have to look that up. All right, Cubbies. That'll go to John G. It, I mean, Cubs it wasn't intentional new... by Tops, but it was... Oh, I see. Okay. There's Derek Rodriguez, jersey and autograph. 38 out of, like, Mike Trout thing. Mike Trout? I forgot what it was, but you posted on Instagram. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The, uh... There's Derek Rodriguez, jersey and autograph. That's for the Giants number block. And that'll be San Francisco 8, 38 out of 99. I'll yeah, this. MC Sub knows what I'm, yeah. It's pretty, it's a pretty viral card in the hobby industry. Okay, I'll have to look for a that. A few years ago. I don't know. I, I don't know what Mike Trout won. I forget what you're talking about, though. I will have to look at our Instagram, but... Yeah. It was like a. I remember this, the uh, the six 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 card. A moment now is definitely. All right, and the next box right here. Yeah, Cooper thinking. Speaking of that Mookie Betts book, is Mookie Betts gonna be a Red Sox for much longer? I think it all depends on whether J D Martinez opts in or out, which I think he's opting in. So. They may not have the money to pay Mookie Bed, so maybe they'll have to try to either convince him to stay for less. Probably not going to happen, but... Or trade him while he still has value. All right, then we have... Nice Brandon Finding Nemo. Two out of 75. That's a number block team. Mets... Two is Conrad. Uh, last spot mojo in that number block. Behind Ozzie Smith is an angel. It's Albert Pujols. 11 out of 18. Piece of his lumber going to Evan, who picked up the angel straight up. Behind Robin Yount is... A triple relic, trio of Dodgers, Walker Bueller, Hyunjin Ryu, and Kenta Maeda. Five out of 18. That'll be for, uh, for Dave. Dave Farley, who picked up the Dodgers. And for the Brew Crew, Eric Thames, jersey and autograph. 29 out of 75. Brewers, Johnny O with the Brew Crew. There we go, John. On the board. All right, here's another box right over here. I texted Jason the Ronda Rousey card. Oh, let me see it. 
Oh, right, right, right. I remember this. Yeah, that Ron Arazio, they, they did not think that through. Um, <laughs> or maybe they did. <laughs> Kershaw, maybe yeah, it was on... They, they got screwed by the jersey relic, how they fell. <laughs> because it just highlights it. Oh, man. Has, I, I wonder if anyone's ever asked Rhonda about that. The sticker auto, right? So she didn't see it beforehand. Yeah. good you would hate to see it in this all right that we pull it there's byron buxton extra base hit first 13 out of 18 for the red sox jonathan kent oh darren was saying earlier the nats have the highest number of fake to real fans in all sports 19 to 1 lots of, did you go out and survey lots of brand new never worn attire will be at the game tomorrow yeah astros too Probably a lot of bandwagon fans. I mean, Astros are so bad that they took them from the NL and they threw them into the AL. They're like, no one's going to care. <laughs> That's how bad they were. They Gregory the, Polanco. They got rid of the hill. 18 out of 36. They should never have gotten rid of the hill in Houston. Pirates. That'll be for Christopher Austin at the Pirates. Oh, sorry. Did I say Red Sox? I meant to. It doesn't matter what I say, Noah. Highest we our, our shipping fans. team goes by the list. <laughs> Highest number of fake fans either Dodgers or Yankees. I mean, it's not close. I, in my opinion. You think there are a lot of fake Dodger fans? A lot, yeah. I think there's a lot of fake Lakers fans. I think fans, there's a lot of the fake Dodger... Dodgers fans that just only go for the postseason. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. And the tickets Two out of 18. Are, tickets are expensive to both Matt teams, Olsen. so it's really like casual fans, you know? At least the Yankees team is expensive. That's it's for probably, the A's. Noah. It's probably the Yankees with how many Yankees, Cowboys, Lakers fans there are. Clint Frazier, Jersey and Autograph, 25 out of 99. Yankees, that'll be for the number block team. Yankees 5, Nancy. And the number of fake Lakers fans is even higher. Yeah, the Lakers fans, I see a lot of fake Lakers fans. Especially now that LeBron is there, they just go whatever team LeBron is. The LeBron stands. A lot of LeBron stands. A lot of, a lot of Lakers fans don't like the LeBron stands because they don't respect Kobe. LeBron doesn't respect Kobe. Those fans don't respect Kobe. Those fans should respect Kobe. What? That's, you got to watch out for the, with, with, with that kind of talk. A lot of Lakers fans in Hermosa Beach. Can't be saying that. That's reckless. Yeah, but don't don't Laker, don't, be for LeBron. don't say that in public. There is a Manny Machado. Fifteen out of eighteen. Manny War. Thirty three point eight. Wow. Don't worry about no Lakers good. fans. <laughs> All those Lakers that live in Manhattan Beach are gonna come down here. All the Cowboys fans. There's no Cowboys fans in LA. All the Cowboys, Lakers, and Eagles. Brett Gardner, 5 out of 27. And like Miami Hurricanes. Yankees, 5. Nancy with that one. Ohio State. They like Ohio State for them. And why are there a lot of Ohio State fans? All right. There is, out of 36, Dustin Pedroia, Laser Show. Vanilla says uh, the, the Patriots have the most bandwagon fans. I feel like everyone hates the Patriots. Jonathan Kent with the red. I don't think so. Yeah, I feel like everyone just hates the Patriots. The Cowboys now. have the most bandwagon. 40 out of 50, Williams Astadio for the Twins. That'll be for Noah. Cowboys and Raiders. Well, no, Ra Raiders, no bandwagon fans for the Raiders. They've been bad for so oh, long. I, I like them now that they moved to Vegas. You hear that? Of Vegas people. I've not heard that. Really? Yeah. Wow, I people guess so. Vegas, yeah, I guess so, yeah. Derek Carr stinks. Yeah, Derek Carr's no... Not great. Not great. <laughs> Yohan Mankata, Ichiro... Clemente to 75, Yachty to 199. 
There's Ryan Sandberg. And there is Joey Lucchese, 16 out of 18. Keep him off base, Joey. That goes to Michael H. and the Friars. And for the Red Sox, we've got Darwinzon Hernandez, 52 out of 99. Jonathan Kent with the Red Sox. There's Ryan Sandberg. And behind Tony Gwynn is Yusai Kikuchi. Nice, there's some good color in there. 20 out of 75, Mariners. Aaron Tooley. I like the RC windows that they made this year. And there's Miguel Cabrera, 30 out of 36, Tigers. That is a number block team. Tigers, zero, Chad B. All right, next box. Noah Syndergaard to 299, Josh Hader to 199, Otani to 299, Conforto to 50. We've got triples. Nice. Triple Relic. Triples. 4 out of 18. Eddie Rosario. He had a really nice season this year. Noah? Noah with the Twins. I feel like the dog and up right here. You ever seen that movie? What? No. The dog and up? you never seen up? Never seen it. Wait, what? The dog and up? You've never seen the movie up? Oh, the Pixar movie? Yeah. But I don't know what, you're what scene you're referencing. He's trying to get the bone to the door and he keeps hitting it. <laughs> right. Okay. Yeah, I remember that. Pretty good scene. It's a pretty good movie. I thought you were gonna say you've never seen Up. Alex Bregman, eighteen out of twenty, definitely seen Up. It's been a while though. I kind of forgot yeah. about it actually. Not when I get Disney Plus though. I'll have all those movies. Bregman going to the Astros. Noah with the Strohs. You'll get that too. The Verlander. Yeah, the running back Liz McGuire. Hell yeah. Twenty-seven out of twenty-seven. Keystone yeah, Mastery, right. Dustin Pedroia. Are they bringing Disney back Plus commercials? Oh, yeah. Disney Plus is going to be great. Sign up for it already. Sure. Dustin Pedroia, Red Sox, Jonathan Kent. Spotify Premium? I don't know how that bundles in. Do you have that? Though? I do. Get your free Google Home. What? 50 bucks. I get a free Google Home? I'll send so, you the link. Yeah, send me the So Google is going to listen to like all the things sure. that I say? JD Martinez you can and put it in here. 4 out of 25? They'll just be like, why is this guy just. Right. <laughs> Talking to himself. We'll get a, all of a sudden we get a lot of like Panini and Tops ads and stuff like that. We're like, oh, that's interesting. Uh, nice JD Martinez going to Jonathan Kent and the Red Sox. Or like two more boxes to go. Therapy ads for talking to yourself. <laughs> right. <laughs> Are you talking to yourself? <laughs> all right. Almost done, ladies and gentlemen. Altuve to 259, Conforto to 299, Ivan Rodriguez 259, Mark McGuire to 299. We've got 28 out of 36, John Lester. Don't test him again. That's for John and the Cubs. Behind Verlander is Jonathan Kent with the Red Sox. Andrew Benintendi, 12 out of 99. Behind Chris Bryant is 5 out of 9, Max Scherzer. Nice. 300 triple relic for Evan and the Nationals. That's a good time to get this one. They're up two games to none on the Astros, taking two in Houston. That's a good looking one right there. Can the Nationals sweep? Is that crazy talk? There's Joey Lucchese. Big relic there for the Padres. 23 out of 27. We were discussing this yesterday. Has a team 
who swept a team in the championship series has gone on to sweep someone in the World Series? The answer is no. We looked it up. Since, yeah, there has never been a back-to-back sweep from the championship series to the World Series. People are acting like they're hot all of a sudden. Haven't they been like 82 and 40 in the last, like, they were, like in the... Oh, yeah, people weren't paying attention to the, to the Nationals. Because they started off the first month of the season garbage when people pay attention. Yeah. But they didn't realize they spent the next three, four months. Yeah. Just like and they won ninety months. games after yeah. being down like thirty games at the beginning of the season. It was crazy. All right, out of twenty-five, Jackie Robinson, Eddie Rosario to one ninety-nine, Buster Posey to seventy-five, and Robin Yount to one ninety-nine. Cooper's getting a Tops Now card if if the if the Nationals sweep. Yeah, Nats could be on an eight-game winning streak. Or they are on an eight-game winning streak, right? After the Dodgers. Yeah, and Strasburg has been figuring out a more of a pitcher now, not just a thrower. Probably better for his, his arm, too, his arm health. Beyond Buster Posey, our last handful of hits, there's Brandon Finding Nemo. One out of 35, triple relic and autograph. For the Metropolitans, that'll be a number block team. Mets one is Mary. Mary with that one. Behind Buster Posey is a Tiger. That's another number block team. That is 20 out of 36. Miguel Cabrera relic for Chad B, who has Detroit zero. And then behind Pedro Martinez, our last two hits. We've got a triple relic out of nine. Three out of nine, Whit Merrifield, Salvador Perez, and Hunter Dozier. That'll be for the X-Line and the Royals. Then after Pedro Martinez is Kyle Schorber. Logan saying Astro's going to win the next four games. Guaranteed, he says. How much money are you putting on that, Logan? 20 out of 50, Kyle Schorber. Cubs pinstripe jersey and his autograph. That'll be for John and the Chicago Cubs. And there you have it, boys and girls. Nice break. That was Triple Threads. Pick your team number four from jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got some more. Check it out. And let's break some more. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.